Hey everyone, Bethany, and I'm going to be explaining a little bit about trips and what it takes place on trips. Um, we make a trip folder, which is a big part of our academics because we have to do menus and itinerary and goals and a lot of other stuff that um, goes through their academics because we write a lot and through the trip we learn, well it doesn't really feel like you're learning, you take in a lot of information. Um, first thing I'll talk about is our goals. Um, we have group goals that we do to better a group and make sure that what we're doing we're going to do right and do it the best way possible. And we have individual goals that everybody will do and it's basically to, we try to make them, one has to be academic so you can learn things throughout the trip, you can write an article. Um, about you, what you've learned. You can write facts, pretty much anything you think of you're going to be learning. And we also have an itinerary which is what we do each day. It plans out where we're going to be and lets our supervisor know. So if anything were to happen he can come get us. Um, we, so this is like a, looks like a calendar. And we write down where we're going to be each day, where we're starting, and where we're going to end up. And we did a couple of these for the Swanee River trip um, because we were worried about water level. So you kind of just have to play with it a little bit to get it right. Mm -hmm. But it's a big part of our trip. And you can also do day trips. So if we didn't do this, we wouldn't get to do day trips because we wouldn't know where anything is. Um, another part is our menus. We all do menus, um, so we eat differently on the river than we would here because we can't have any fresh meat or fresh bread, but we can have crackers and Slim Jims and beef jerky, and it actually turns out pretty good. We've made some amazing menus. Um, we have to meet certain requirements each day by the state, and so even though we're on a river trip, those still count. Um, well, for any trip. And we have a certain budget per person. You can have two dollars. So you can, um, you can do a lot with two dollars per person, actually. It teaches you how to use a budget and that you'll use outside of camp. So that's how we plan a trip.